how long has it been since the Ducks have had a good third line? I mean, you go back to the Stanley Cup season, and even then, with a notable exception of during the playoffs, that line of Sammy Paulson and uh, Rob Niedermeyer and Travis Moen didn't necessarily produce a whole lot of offense. I don't think the Ducks are going to continue to count on or receive the same amount of offense from the third line as they've gotten in the first two games. But if that line can be a threat offensively and hold its own defensively, particularly playing against top offensive players on the other side, that's a huge boost for the Ducks. Well, we didn't come off the road celebrating like we just uh, you know, won those two games and, and we're the best team in the league. We, we know that we uh, can play a lot better and we want to play better, we want to play for each other and play hard and, uh, and that's a sign of a, a good team. Well I think a big part is because a lot of guys from last year are still here so uh, it's not, uh, I mean we know what, what Bruce wants us to play, uh, we kind of like didn't start from scratch and the new, new guys they, they fit in pretty well. And I think in this shortened season with a shortened training camp there are going to be uh, a lot of teams struggling to find their way and if you can win and pick up points while you're trying to improve, all the better. And that's what the Ducks did in their opening two games.